was right about buying stock and parachutes. Nice! Very nice! Wasn't kidding. Let them take you away, princess. Thank you ever so much for saving me. I'll be sure to keep you safe. Let's go! Keep it steady. I'll hold these guys off. I've never flown anything like this... this thing before. It's called a helicopter. And I have faith in you, Princess. Please! My name in your language is Quilana. Quilana, then. I believe in you. Are you fucking kidding me? Keep it in front! We're gonna hit! We're gonna crash! That's not good! What's happening? We're going down! Are you okay? You crash like a pro. And cut! Beautiful! Play the roll with the punches and improvise, man. I loved it. Guess that wasn't so bad. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mr. Jen. I'm glad you... Yeah, I was talking to our star, not you. You had the emotional range of a bagel. And like one of those shitty whole grain bagels that nobody likes. All right, let's set up the next shot. Jenny, don't listen to him. You're doing great. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, we're rolling. And... Make some magic! Up ahead! Let's take that car! There are guards all around! I knew that looked great! I love watching you do that! Sorry, I forgot the line. Nice ad lib. Thanks! Quit love Stay in character! God, is this your first acting job? I mean, thanks! Have audio make a pass on that later. How many guys is he throwing at us? Uh, you mean your military leaders? Oh, Jen! He's kind of bordering on crazy. Oh.
execute it. Damn microwave if you don't start working! Wait, what? Ugh. I'm getting no service out here. I hate this fucking phone! Oh, shit. Sorry. <laughs> Jenny. Less talking, more driving! Move on. It's not worth it. It's okay. <laughs> I'm just going with the flow. Okay! Actionis! That doesn't look possible! Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea! God! What the hell was that, Jemima? A child could have made that jump! A crippled child! That was blind! Are you fucking high? Did you see how far it was? Listen, I'm really sorry. Please, please don't let this ruin our relationship. This is 100% the casting director's fault, I swear. Are you crazy? He's the director. I don't care who he is. You shouldn't take shit like that from anyone. All right, let's reset and do that again. Okay, faster with more intensity and less sucking. And... Play ball! Here we go. You know what? Fuck that. Turn up ahead. Th but that's off script. I'm rewriting this shit. Trust me. Joe! What the hell are you doing? This works better. Just keep filming. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. I see what you're doing. Brilliant. Let's go with this. Are you sure this is a good idea? You gotta learn to stand up for yourself. I'm not sure I can do that. Even with how he's treating me. Stick with me, sweetheart. I'll show you how it's done. Be safe. Now. Onward! Cut! That's a wrap for today. Amazing work from most of you. Not naming names, because I've already forgotten your names because you are worthless. Now get off my set!
Um, 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 you don't know me, but I'm your biggest fan. And I, well, I need your help. You know Smiling Jack Shiner? Meet me there and I'll explain everything. It was a dark and stormy night. The heavens wept as I defiled Mother Nature. Johnny, we're about to jump! Right on. I'll see you in still. Johnny? They failed you, Johnny. But I never will. I'm your number one fan. For months, I've been collecting shit. Hey, shit. Sunglasses, old chewed up gum, a greasy comb. I thought I had had enough things that he touched. I was wrong. Cloned Gat? Yeah. All right, so where is... I'm getting to that part. Find our friend. Yeah, let's do this. Sit the fuck down, Jimmy. Leave this to the professionals. Can you at least give me an autograph? And so our adventure begins. You have any idea where to start? If it's really Johnny, he'll want a gun. We're heading to friendly fire. Everything this town has to offer, and that would be his first thought. It was mine when I got here. Yeah. But you knew we had to take on the Syndicate. A clone of Gat ain't gonna know that. Or Jimmy, he still thinks he's out to avenge Aisha. Shit, good point. Would have thought maybe Gat would have been at Planet Saints. Guess not. Indeed, their friend had not been to the purveyor of weapons close by. But perhaps the next merchant would prove more enlightening. Morningstar? Think they're after Johnny too? I don't know. We better check it out. Here are heroes approaching. Foot soldiers of the notorious Morningstar game rain down a hail of books. Here are the privilege of each instant must hold a clue to the whereabouts of their friend. Keeping one alive was the only avenue for answers. What the hell do you want? Tell me what the Morningstar was doing here and I might let you live. As long as you don't give me to that brute. He attacked some of our guys nearby, so we were tracking him down. Now, can I go? Shh, we better find Gap before these guys do. 
The Saints realized they had no idea where to continue the search. But they... Leave this to us, will you, kid? Looks like you may have gone to the strip club. Gee, that sounds like Johnny. to the stage-like advice of their intelligent and trusted friend. They raced over to the local strip joint, ready to deal with a full police investigation. But when they arrived... Where's all the police? I don't know, Jimmy was probably wrong about him. Damn! Would you look at this mess? I already called the police! Look at what you saints did to my club! Hold up, man. We didn't have nothing to do with it. Listen, you better start talking. What happened here? Jesus! That big guy came in screaming his name and something about stripper poles and then started trashing the place! People panicked and he ran off! At that moment, little did they know the building was being surrounded. Time for this, Jimmy! I know! I heard on the police scanner that Addy's trapped inside! I have a way to track Gaddy! It's just right there! Jimmy? Shit! I guess we're holding out here till that kid shows up. And so it was. The Saints began their stand as technical legal. Determined to stay alive long enough to be saved from the police by their daring ally, they opened fire on the hordes of enemies bearing down on them. The danger was extreme, but they found the courage to endure. Never once did they lose faith in their friend. That kid ain't coming. Let's go there, boss. Oh shit, they called in the SWAT teams! smoke and hope was restored the hero of the day arrived unafraid and ready for action hurry up and get out of here these guys are everywhere come on hurry we need to get out of here That explains so much. I can track down on my device here. Just keep us safe, all right? Having arrived just in time to save the saints from certain death, the three set out on a chase to the metropolis of Steelport in search of their clone form. Amazed by the device built for such a purpose, they asked for an explanation on how it worked. So you see, with the DNA from the Gat clone programmed into this bio scanner, I can look for traces of. I'm a little busy, and I don't care how it works, just that it does. He's faster than I had anticipated.
There's another roadblock ahead. We have to get through it. These guys seem to be more worried about us than the giant cat clone. Waste of time. Don't worry, I have a backup plan. Trust me. Thanks for the ride. Tonight's been a great night, and it's not slowing up, Bobby. An incredible night, Zach. And now, it's time for the main event. I can't wait. Let's do it. <laughs> there he is, Bobby. Eddie Kilbane Pryor, the walking apocalypse himself. You can't help but wonder how the Stillwater Butcher can't compete. I'll tell you, Zach, this psycho is a complete whack job. <laughs> You know, when he came out of the womb, this guy literally choked out the doctor with his own umbilical cord. He's that fucking sick. I'll be ringside keeping luchadors off your ass while you finish Killbane. Good luck, man. Well, there it is, Bobby. The Saints receiving no love here. Not at all. It is raining hate down where they are. And of course it is. After what their capo did to Stillwater, they're lucky the fans aren't knifing them on their way to the ring. Wait, oh my god, look at that. It's Angel de la Muerte. Angel de la Muerte, the second half of a pale riders, sometimes regarded as the herald of a walking apocalypse. The youngest wrestler to ever win the Super K Cup is here in the Steel Court Arena. History is writing itself tonight, Zach. After his questionable loss to Kilbane years ago, Angel dropped off the face of the earth. If you're a fan of Murder Brawl, this is shaping up to be the best night of your life. Time to get to work. All right, here we go. And here's the Butcher of Stillwater swaggering in. And speaking of surprises, here comes the Luchadors in force. The Butcher getting some help from the fans. This has just turned into a lumberjack match from hell. 
All right, Bobby, you know, this is a classic matchup. Speed versus power, youth versus age, brains versus brawn. Well, you know, the fact that these two are tag team partners really adds another layer to the whole dimension. They train together. They know... You saw it here, folks. This ref is missing easy calls here. What's going on? Don't think I'm forgetting what we were talking about, Bobby. You know, you're right, Bobby. The last time... Holy sh... Oh my god, the no angel is out of the ring! I can't believe this, Bobby. This is punishing to watch. The luchadors are manhandling angels. This is sick. He's getting kicked around like a sack full of dead puppies. Jeez, oh, wait. The butcher of Stillwater is making his way towards Angel. How much can one person be expected to Oh my god! A chainsaw! What the f Oh my god! A fatal flaw in the Luchador's plan, Bobby. They didn't account for the murder brawl chainsaw. It was a desperate move for a desperate time, but it looks like the gamble has paid off. Now this is what people came here to see. The Butcher of Stillwater on an unstoppable rampage. Kill bait.